We received a bag that is not only great for the Nintendo Switch, but it's perfect for your everyday carry. This is the Commuter Pack by Funk Street Outfitters. Welcome to A Came From A Box, I'm Sergio AM, and recently a company by the name Funk Street Outfitters reached out to us after watching some of the Nintendo Switch bag videos we made. They asked if we'd like to collaborate with them to share their own minimal but feature-filled bag, which is great for the Nintendo Switch, but is also perfect for everyday carry, as I just said on the tease. After doing some research and looking into it, we knew there was something special here, so we agreed, and this is the Commuter Pack, launching today on Kickstarter. Let's take a look. At first glance, it looks like a discreet, low-profile bag, but once you get closer, the details come into focus. On the exterior, we have very light and durable ripstop nylon in this attractive honeycomb pattern. As you can see, it has some reflective properties to it similar to the 3M strip that goes across the front here. This helps make you more visible in the dark to cars, but also say you're outdoors camping at night and you drop this black bag on the ground, well, it easily pops against a flashlight. On the left, right, and bottom, we have D-rings for all types of attachments. On the back, we have very comfortable air mesh cushioning. Then the main compartment is easily accessed via a Fidlock buckle, which is a multi-award winning fastening system and personally, my all-time favorite. It opens by tilting the steel flap via this little cord, which detaches it. To close it, you just bring them together and it utilizes magnets to securely snap it into place. You can always find me fidgeting with these things because I just, I just love them so much. Sorry. On the side here, you'll find that we have side vent covers and these help keep rain out when the bag's closed. Then at the top of that flap, we have Molly webbing to use with something like a U-lock for cyclists. Up front, we have two pockets with YKK AquaGuard reverse zippers. These help keep whatever's inside them dry, such as Joy-Cons or any other type of tech. And on the left one, we have a cable pass-through, which you can use for earbuds or a charging cable. Now over to the main compartment, we have a soft microfiber sleeve that's padded due to the air mesh on the back. In it, you can fit up to a full-sized 10.6 inch tablet, and in front of it, we have a smaller sleeve for your phone. Then opposite of that, we have a zippered compartment with a pen sleeve above, another nylon sleeve on the side, and a keychain attachment right down the middle. Now the main compartment itself is big enough for all sorts of stuff, but we used it to carry our Poker 3 and mainly the Nintendo Switch. You can store it with a small case or pouch, with a protective case or grip, and of course by itself, and you'll still have enough room for additional cables and accessories. And that covers the interior. Uh, finally, on the exterior, you can use the adjustable strap to wear it on your waist, or you can attach the removable shoulder pad to wear it like a sling or messenger bag, and you also get an action strap that attaches to the bottom D-ring and main strap to keep the bag from moving around. So the three takeaways are, one, it looks great and it's very well made. Two, it's competitively priced at $75 with early birds as low as 60. Similar bags almost always cost more. And I say that because the last Kickstarter bag I backed was about $200, but retails for 300. This one is built of the same or similar materials and components at a fraction of the cost. And three, they offer a lifetime warranty. That alone goes to show how much they believe in this product, and it's what made me believe in it as well. So the Commuter Pack launched today on Kickstarter, and as I said, I am collaborating with them. So if you'd like to get your hands on one of these and support both Funk Street as well as this channel, we have a referral link down in the description below. Uh, they're trying to reach a goal of $12,500 by April 12. So if you like what you see, Let's make it happen. As always, let me know what you think about this bag. I'm curious to see what you guys have to say. I'm Sir Joe AM, and as always, I'll see you for the next box. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video and want to help us out, you can do so by clicking that thumbs up button. And while you're at it, why not subscribe for more content? It's free. We also love to hear you out, so please leave a comment down below or talk with us on Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook. I'm Sir Joe AM, and I'll see you for the next box.